The evolution of tectonophysics is closely linked to the history of the continental drift and plate tectonics hypotheses. The continental drift, Airy Haskinen isostasy hypothesis, had many flaws and scarce data. The fixist, Pratt Hayford isostasy, the contracting Earth and the expanding Earth concepts had many flaws as well. The idea of continents with a permanent location, the geosyncline theory, the Pratt-Hayford isostasy, the extrapolation of the age of the Earth by Lord Kelvin as a black body cooling down, the contracting Earth, the Earth as a solid and crystalline body, is one school of thought. A lithosphere creeping over the asthenosphere is a logical consequence of an Earth with internal heat by radioactivity decay, the airy Haskinen isostasy, thrust faults and Niskanen's mantle viscosity determinations. Topic making sense of the puzzle pieces 1953, the Great Global Rift, running along the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, was discovered by Bruce Heason Lamont Group, Puzzle Pieces, Seismic Refraction and Sonar Survey of the Rifts, Ewing and Ewing 1959, Heason 1960, Heason and Tharp 1961, Heason and Tharp 1964, Heason and Tharp 1966 Their World Ocean Floor map was published 1977. Austrian painter Heinrich Baran worked on it. Nowadays the seafloor maps have a better resolution by the SEASAT, Geosat, ERM and ERS-1, ERM European Remote Sensing Satellite, Exact Repeat Mission Missions, McAdoo 2006 World Map of Earthquake Epicenters, Oceanic Ones Mainly Rothay 1954. 1954 to 1963, Alfred Rittmann was elected IAV president, IAV at that time for three periods. 1956, S. K. Runcorn becomes a drifter. Frankel, 1987, p. 221. Runcorn, 1956. Statistics by Ronald Fisher. Frankel, 1987, p. 221. Runcorn, 1956. Jan Hosper's work. Magnetic poles and geographical poles coincide the last 23 ma. Self-exciting dynamo theory of Elsesser Bullard. S. W. Carey, Plate Tectonics Carey 1956. But he believed here in an expanding Earth. 1958, Henry William Menard notes that most mid-ocean ridges are halfway between the two continental edges Menard 1958 cited in Bullard 1975. Seafloor spreading December 1960, Harry H. Hess preprint and a report for the Navy, Sonar and Seafloor Spreading, Personal Communication formally published in 1962 Puzzle Pieces, His World War II Seafloor Profiles, Carey 1958, Venning Minas 1948, Oceanic Gravity Anomalies and the Great Global Rift, Hess 1962, Hess 1960B, Hess 1960A, Hess 1959, 1961, Robert S. Dietz, Dietz 1961. Dot, 1961, the Permian Tillite at Squantum, Massachusetts, was reclassified as turbidite. It was used as argument by anti-drifters. PMS Blakett 1960, Blakett's former lecturer S. K. Runcorn 1962, Runcorn's former student E. Irving, Paleomagnetism. References, Frankel 1987, p. 221, Blackett, Clegg and Stubbs 1960, Runcorn 1959, Runcorn 1962A, Irving and Green 1958, Irving 1960, Creer, Irving and Runcorn 1957, 1962, S.K. Runcorn applies the Rayleigh's theory of convection. Convection occurs if viscosity under the crust is less than 1026 to 1027 CGS units. Runcorn 1962B, 1962, Subduction in the Aleutian Islands, Robert R. Coates, USGS, Coates 1962, Wonderlich, H.G., March 1962. 
50 Yara Continental Verschiebungstheorie, von Wegener bis Runcorn, 50 Years Continental Drift Hypothesis, Wegener to Runcorn. Geologische Rundschau. 52 1, 504 to 513. Bibcode 1962Georu.52504W. DOI 10.1007/BF0184095. The uncertainty of the distance between Europe and North America is too great to confirm the continental drift hypothesis. It states wrongly that the lock and key form of South America and Africa is less good if the continental shelf is taken into account. Note the truth is that neither A. Wegener nor C. Scutchert used the east coastline of South America and west coastline of Africa. Really, these coastlines don't fit Bullard 1975. Topic Plate Tectonics Publication of the Vine Matthews Morley Hypothesis, Frankel 1987, p. 228, Vine 1963, Frederick Vine is working under Drummond Matthews, University of Cambridge. Lawrence W. Morley's independent paper was not accepted. John Tuzo Wilson, a former fixist, contractionist up to around 1959. Frankel 1987, p. 231 J. T. Wilson spends much of 1965 in Cambridge and Hess joined him on the second half. Wilson develops the transform fault concept, Wilson 1962, Wilson 1963A, Wilson 1963B, Wilson 1963C, Wilson 1965A, Wilson cycle, Wilson 1966. Frederick Vine, applies the transform fault concept, the Vine-Matthews-Morley hypothesis and the seafloor spreading concept on the Juan de Fuca ridge. He does not get a constant spreading rate as the Jaramillo reversal geomagnetic reversal is unknown, Vine and Wilson 1965 PMS. Blackett, E.C. Bullard and S.K. Runcorn, E.D.S., 1965. A Symposium on Continental Drift, 28 October 1965. Philosophical Transactions of the Royal Society A 258-1088, I by, 1-323, A1-A6, CS1 maint, uses editor's parameter link Bullard, Everett and Smith 1965, Wilson 1965B, Heason and Tharp 1965. Wells, finds on growth rings of Devonian corals the maximum Earth expansion during this time to be less than 0.6 mm per year Wells 1963, Marvin 1966, p. 60. Heason, abandons the expanding Earth theory as it requires a radial expansion of 4 to 8 mm per year for the Atlantic Ocean alone Heason 1966. 1966, East South America and West Africa, rocks and their ages match where they were joint, South Africa, Santa de la Ventana, Argentina, Ghana, São Luís do Maranhão, Brazil, nowadays, the fit between Africa and South America is based on paleomagnetism, slightly different from the older Bullard's fit based on least square fitting of 500 fathom c. 900 meters contours across the Atlantic, Bullard, Everett and Smith 1965, Torsvik et al. 2001, Closure, November 1965, Geological Society of America, Brent Dalrymple, Brent Dalrymple, Richard Dole and Alan V. Cox, USGS, brought to Frederick Vine attention that there is the Jaramillo reversal, PUBL, mid-1966, Frankel 1987, p. 234, Dole and Dalrymple 1966, February 1966. Vine visits the Lamont group Walt Pittman and Neil Opdyke and tells them that their discovered emperor reversal was already named as Jaramillo reversal. 
and shows the reversal on the Walt Pittman's graphic CM, vertical, surprising Pittman, Opdyke and even himself Ninkovich et al. 1966, Vine 1966. Many anti-drifters changed their mind after the publication of these magnetometer readings of sediment core Eltonin 19, geomagnetic reversals Le Grand 1990. The Vine-Matthews-Morley hypothesis is the first scientific test to confirm the seafloor spreading concept. Earth Science's paradigm shift, from fixed continents to plate tectonics Wilson 1968, magnetometer readings of sediment cores, geomagnetic reversals, ratio of CM vertical. Magnetic profiles of seafloor, geomagnetic reversals, ratio of KM horizontal. Radiometric analysis of lava flows, geomagnetic reversals, ratio of Ma time, Frankel 1987, p. 235 Conference in New York in November 1966, sponsored by NASA Finney 1968 cited in Bullard 1975. Maurice Ewing to Edward Bullard, you don't believe all this rubbish, do you, Teddy? Even Maurice Ewing Lamont Doherty Earth Observatory came to accept seafloor spreading by April 1967 and cited along with his brother John Ewing the case for Vine Matthews Morley hypothesis as strong support for the hypothesis of spreading. Frankel 1987, p. 230 Ewing, John, Ewing, Maurice the 20 3rd of June 1967. Sediment distribution on the mid-ocean ridges with respect to spreading of the sea floor. Science, 156 3782, 1590-1592. Bibcode, 1967 Psi, 0.156, 1590E. Doi 10.1126 science.1561982.1590 PMID 17797640 Around 1967 Marshall K becomes a drifter Frankel 1987 p 230 in 1967, W. Jason Morgan proposed that the Earth's surface consists of 12 rigid plates that move relative to each other Morgan 1968. Two months later, in 1968, Xavier Le Pichon published a complete model based on six major plates with their relative motions Le Pichon 1968, received 2 January 1968. The Englishman Dan Mackenzie and Robert Parker published the quantitative principles for plate tectonics Euler's rotation theorem, individual aseismic areas move as rigid plates on the surface of a sphere, quote, a block on a sphere can be moved to any other conceivable orientation by a single rotation about a properly chosen axis, Mackenzie and Parker 1967. Note I, although Morgan 1968 received 30 August 1967, revised 30 November 1967 and published 15 March 1968 was published later than Mackenzie and Parker 1967 published 30 December 1967, priority belongs to Morgan. It is based on a presentation at the American Geophysical Union's 1967 meeting title, Rises, Trenches, Great Faults, and Crustal Blocks. Note 2, W. Jason Morgan shared with Fred Vine an office in the Princeton University for two years, and a scientific paper from H. W. Minard drifted his attention to plate tectonics. It was probably the long faults on Minard 1967 cited in Morgan 1968 and the Euler's rotation theorem that gave him the idea. End of the continental drift controversy in the USA, North Atlantic, Geology and Continental Drift, a Symposium 1969, American Association of Petroleum Geologists AAPG, K1969 cited in, Krill 2011.
Topic Geodynamics John F. Dewey applies plate tectonics Dewey 1970. Plate tectonics, mantle plume controversy, Cowan 1975, Jordan 2007, the relationship between subducted seafloor, flood basalts and continental rifting is uncovered, Morgan 1971, Morgan 1972, Rampino and Stuthers 1988, Silver, Carlson and Olson 1988, White 1989, Segev 2002, Plume Tectonics, Zuwansk and Woodhouse 1987, Fukao et al., 1992, Maruyama 1994 Slab Pull Force, Slab Suction Force Back Arc Basin and Ridge Push Force, Back Arc Basin Molnar and Awater 1978, Barker and Hill 1980, Martinez et al. 1995 similar to a landslide seafloor sinks and subducts Forsyth and Aida 1975 Hager and O'Connell 1981 Kerr 1995 Anderson 2001 Conrad and Lithgow Bertoloni 2002 Wilson cycle slab pull subduction opens a space on western South America and the sliding seafloor away from the mid-Atlantic ridge on eastern South America occupies the new available space. Overview, viscous resistance, slab thickness, slab bending, trench migration and seismic coupling, slab width, slab edges and mantle return flow, Clinton P. Conrad, Susan Bilek, Carolina Lithgow Bertoloni 2004. Great Earthquakes and Slab Pull, Interaction Between Seismic Coupling and Plate Slab Coupling PDF. Earth and Planetary Science Letters. 218 1, 109-122. Bibcode, 2004E and PSL.218, 109C. CiteCRX 10.1.1.506.2266. doi, 10.1016, S00128211X03006435. Lalamand, S., A. Huret, and D. Boutelier. 2005. On the relationships between slab dip, back arc stress, upper plate absolute motion, and crustal nature in subduction zones. PDF. Geochemistry Geophysics Geosystems. 6 9, Q09006. Bibcode, 2005GGG, 609006L. DOI 10.1029/2005GC00917. Archived from the original PDF on the 21st of July 2011. Retrieved the 14th of August 2012. CS1 maint. Multiple names. Authors list. Link. W. P. Schellert, D. R. Stegman, R. J. Farrington, J. Freeman, and L. Morrissey. The 16th of July 2010. Cenozoic tectonics of Western North America controlled by evolving width of Farallon slab. Science. 329 5989 316 to 319 Bibcode 2010sci.329/316s doi 101126 science.1190366 PMID 20647465 Current Plate Motions, Demetz et al. 1990, Argus et al. 2010, Demetz, Gordon and Argus 2010 Pacific Plate, Lower Mantle has a greater viscosity Monastersky 1996A Tibetan Plateau, Collision Generates Heat Nelson 1996, Monastersky 1996B Paleogeography Irving 2005 and Krill 2011, Order Cycadales, Genus Boenia family Araucariaceae found in Norfolk Island Island, Australia, Vanuatu, New Caledonia, Papua New Guinea, Indonesia, Malaysia, Philippines, New Guinea, Argentina, Chile, and southern Brazil. 
Coal fossils found on the British Isles. Magnolia, subgenus Magnolia, section Magnolia, found in the Neotropic Ecozone section Guillemia, found in Asia including Borneo section Blumiana, found in Asia, including Sumatra and Borneo section Talama, found in the Neotropic Ecozone section Manglietia, found in Asia section K. Maria, found in Asia section Rhytodospermum, found in Asia and Magnolia tripetala L. L. in Southeast USA Section Auriculata, Magnolia Friseri Walt, found in Southeast USA Section Macrophylla, Magnolia Macrophylla Michx, found in Southeast USA Magnolia, Subgenus Eulania, Section Eulania, found in Asia and Magnolia Acuminata L, L found in East USA Section Michelia, found in Asia including the Indomalaya Ecozone Note, a bee fossil of the genus Melitosphex, is considered an extinct lineage of pollen collecting Apoidea sister to the modern bees, and dates from the early Cretaceous c. 100 ma. Insect pollinated flowering plants need bees unranked taxon Anthophila, of the superfamily Apoidea. Beetles may have originated during the lower Permian, up to 299 ma. Flies evolved c. 250 ma, moths and wasps evolved c. 150 ma. Lockwood, John P., Hazlitt, Richard W., 2010. Volcanoes, Global Perspectives, p. 552. ISBN 978-1-4051-6250-0, total estimated radiogenic heat release from neutrino research, 19 terawatts total directly observed heat release through Earth's surface, 31 terawatts seismic anisotropy Becker 2008, Creamer 2009, Conrad and Ben 2010, Plate Reconstruction, Torsvik, Trondhelga and Gaina, Carmen, Center for Geodynamics at NGU Geological Survey of Norway, PGP Physics of Geological Processes, University of Oslo, Norway, Muller, R. Dietmar, Earthbite Group, University of Sydney, Scotis, C.R., Ziegler, A.M. and Van der Vu, R., University of Michigan, University of Chicago and University of Texas, Arlington, Ziegler, P.A. and Stampfli, Gerard, University of Basel and University of Lausanne, Torsvik et al. 2010, Ziegler 1990, Stampfli and Burrell 2004, Global Plate Reconstructions with Velocity Fields from 150 Ma to Present in 10 Ma Increments. Topic overview Many concepts had to be changed, uniformitarianism instead of catastrophism. Empirical science instead of creationism. Plutonism instead of Neptunism, but hydrothermal secondary mineralization occurs. Seafloor of Sema instead of Cial. Baron Kelvin got the age of the Earth too short. The concept of Earth crust and mantle. Airy Haskinen isostasy model instead of the Pratt Hayford model. Thrust faults had to be accepted. The expanding Earth and the contracting Earth concept had to be given up. The shifting and evolution of knowledge and concepts were from Eduard Zeus, Alpine Geology, Theory of Thrusting as a Modification of the Geosyncline Hypothesis, Zeus 1875, then to Alfred Wegener, Continental Drift, Wegener 1912A, Wegener 1929, then to Arthur Holmes, A Model with Convection, Holmes 19 44, then to Felix Andres Venning Minas gravity anomalies along the oceanic trenches implied that the crust was moving and A. Rittman subduction, Venning Minas 1959, Rittman 1951, then to Samuel Warren Carey, Plate Tectonics, Carey 1958, Harry Hammond Hess and Robert S. Dietz seafloor spreading, Hess 1962, Dietz 1961, then to John Tuzo 
Wilson seafloor spreading, Wilson 1963B, transform faults, Wilson 1965A and Wilson cycle, Wilson 1966, then to the confirmation of the vine matthews morley hypothesis, Vine 1963 and paradigm shift, Vine 1966 and Wilson 1968, then to Jason Morgan, Dan McKenzie and Robert Parker quantification of plate tectonics, Morgan 1968, McKenzie and Parker 1967, its uncertainty was quantified by Theodore C. Chong, and then to computer simulation with slab pull and ridge push Forsyth and Aida 1975, Hager and O'Connell 1981, Kerr 1995 and Conrad and Lithgow Bertoloni 2002 with nice works published by the Scripps Institution of Oceanography, the Earthbite Group R. Dietmar Müller and the Center for Geodynamics, Trondhelga Torsvik and Carmen Gaina. Actually, there were two main schools of thought that pushed plate tectonics forward, the alternative concepts to e.g. Harold Jeffrey's group, James Hutton, Eduard Zeus, Alfred Wegener, Alexander du Toit, Arthur Holmes and Felix Andries Venning Minas, together with J.H.F. Umgrove, B.G. Escher and P.H. H. Kunin. Holmes, Venning Minas and Umbgrove had some experience in Burma or Indonesia Pacific Ring of Fire. The Alpine Geology School of Thought, Zeus 1875, Argand 1916, Argand 1922, Ampferer 1920, Schwinner 1941 and Rittmann 1951. With the theory of thrusting, naps, thrust faults and subductions. The Princeton University group around H. H. Hess, Felix Andres Venning Minas, Harry Hammond Hess, John Tuzo Wilson, W. Jason Morgan and Frederick Vine. Overview of Plate Tectonics in, Kiri, Klepis and Vine 2009. Venning Minas, together with J. H. F. Umgrove, B. G. Escher and P. H. H. Kunin had more evidence that the established paradigm and the reality do not match. But as all geophysicists he could not really believe in crust motions in such a large scale and he knew Wegener's continental drift hypothesis fate too. Hess 1962 accumulated even more evidence, but he prudently introduced them as geopoetry, quote, Little of Umbgrove 1947 brilliant summary remains pertinent when confronted by the relatively small but crucial amount of information collected in the intervening years. Like Umbgrove, I shall consider this paper an essay in geopoetry. The IAV, IAVEI board i.e., B.G. Escher and A. Rittman probably never dumped the idea that the South Atlantic is under extension. And the anti-drifters were in a way right as well. Although convection would mix up the mantle and make it homogeneous. The seafloor cycle with subduction and upwelling is something between conduction and convection, it allows for its inhomogeneity in a quasi-steady state. The mantle and the continents are in a way passive, the heat sink of the earth is the seafloor. So that the heat generated in the Earth gets neutralized, Wegener's continental drift hypotheses is a logical consequence of the theory of thrusting alpine geology, the isostasy, the continent's forms resulting from the supercontinent Gondwana break up, the past and present day life forms on both sides of the Gondwana continent margins, and the Permo Carboniferous moraine deposits in South Gondwana. Topic. Graphics The Digital Tectonic Activity Map DTAM, was produced by Paul Lohman and colleagues at NASA GSFC, 1998. NASA, JPL, courtesy of Michael B. Heflin, 2007.9. Seabird, 2003-2. Dr. Ron Blakey, Northern Arizona University.
Topic. See also. Timeline of the development of tectonophysics before 1954. Chronological listing of significant events in the history of tectonophysics. Topic. Further reading. Gohau, Gabriel. 1990. A History of Geology. New Brunswick, N.J., Rutgers University Press. ISBN 978-0-8135-1665-3. Wessel, P., Muller, R.D. 2007. Plate Tectonics. In Anthony B. Watts, ed. Treatise on Geophysics, Crust and Lithosphere Dynamics. 6. Elsevier pp. 49-98. NYC Regional Geology, Mesozoic Basins. USGS. Wilson Cycle, an A-plate tectonic rock cycle. Lynn S. Fichter.